Okay, I don't really have that much of a video for you guys this week because I've been pretty busy with other projects. Um, but I thought I'd just get a quick video done. I've been experimenting with um, cutting up boards on a bandsaw, kind of like a mill. Stuff like this, just from a log, you just set up a fence and run it through there. And um, it's turning out pretty good. I've done quite a few of these. So I was been thinking about making a video for it and I figured I'd save it for a, a week when I'm kind of busy and don't really want to do a project. So um, that's what I'll be doing today. Let me show you what I'm doing. Me and my dad are finally finishing up the drywall job in my video shop. on this will be up, I don't know, maybe in a month. I don't really know when we're going to finish it. We are going to paint the walls and um, all that good stuff. But uh, I'm not quite sure when that'll be done because it's actually pretty cold right now. It's like 40 degrees in here and um, it's too cold to paint. So we're just going to finish up the sanding job and everything with uh, mud. And um, we'll wait until it starts getting warm or just wait for a warm sunny day to do that. First thing, locate your wood. Check. It's pretty important that your work surface on the log, in my case this was just a piece of some split firewood, but it has to be pretty flat and it'll just be a lot easier that way while you're cutting it on the bandsaw. A joiner would be ideal for doing this kind of work. I don't have one though, so I'm sticking to a hand plane. I'm also going to create somewhat of a flat spot just on the bottom edge here for um, something for the bandsaw to push down against. I just set up this uh, two by four clamped down to my table uh, square because this bandsaw never came with a rip fence. I inherited it, so it is what it is. So I'm just gonna plug this in and we can start cutting up our boards.
So those are pretty much what most of the boards look like. Uh, some of these pieces weren't as wide as the others, but they're still good wood, so I'm saving them. And last but not least, little dab end grain sealer. Um, the ends of this stuff will really help to uh, keep this from checking. Alright, that's pretty much for it for this week. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe if you want more. Uh, check back. Actually, no. Next Friday is the Easter weekend, so I will not have a video up. I'm taking the week off. So, two weeks I'll put up a video. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys then.